Hi guys, in this video, we are going to discuss how to deploy the copilot uh, bot that we have created in any of the website, right? So all the work that we have done, it has to be published somewhere, right? Uh, we cannot test it over here, what we have, right? So let's see how to publish it. So by default, uh, copilot provides channels over here, right? So what we will do is there are various channel available from there. One is their demo website, right? So if I click over here, it provides me something called this, which I can leverage. And if I open it, it will give me a demo page already been created by Microsoft, right? Uh, but we will also see how to use in our website. So this one you can see over here, I can check for uh, flip card shopping something like that and ah uh, stupidity of me okay so you did you saw that uh, when i asked flip card shopping it gives me something like uh, sorry didn't understand why because something called publish we have to publish the board for the external world what you are testing over here what appears over here is uh you can set a draft model once you click it publish it goes as a you can consider it as a production release right so what we will do is we are publishing it now to the production we'll pause the video till the time it get published now the content got published let me just refresh this page just to see if it is working properly or not flip card shop just oops Okay, so now anyway, it is detecting. Let's see, uh, Xbox. Is the spelling is correct? Yeah, Xbox. Uh, it's taking too much time to display. So it display the information over here uh, with respect to the gaming console and all those things. And obviously if I click over here, it or redirects me to the Flipkart website, right? Oh, I like this one. Anyway, uh, the requirement was to connect with the custom website, okay? So the for custom website, it gives me something called this iframe, right? What I will do is I will create a one HTML page. Uh, so let it give test.html, remove everything. And let me click, right click edit and paste it over here, right? Let's open this one. So since it is a iframe, uh, it will load automatically and we don't have to publish to a server for now, at least. Okay, so we can see that, uh, oh my God, this looks very horrible. What I will do is I will copy this. I will ask my friend GPT. I have this code of iframe. Make it look like chatbot. Okay. So let's see what it gives me and if we can leverage the content it's providing. Okay, so it has generated something over here. I will copy the code. I will just, instead of this, I will paste and see if this looks better now. Okay, this looks much, much, much better now. But uh, okay, it's loading up. Okay, it's this way better. So I will say uh, how to protect from COVID-19. I think that was the question, right? Uh, let's see. Once I get a response, yep. So we got the response. It also gives the citation. It gives the details from where it has pulled. The information you can also click over here to get the details of the citation right uh, let's see the other one uh, what is that uh, flip card shopping 
that use case uh, what I will buy cello uh, bottle let's see if it does return something it seems uh, there was some HTTP server error. Uh, what will you like to buy so I will again start the journey shopping and this time we will give something like Puma sneakers right so let's see if it able to fetch and display okay so it is able to display and uh, information over here if you click over here it will redirect to the Puma this look nice anyway uh, so yeah this is how we can deploy the uh, website uh, sorry uh, copilot to any of the website it provides the iframe and if you want this code snippet code which was generated by the uh, chat GPT I can I have posted this one over there in my github link you can find it over here uh, and also in the description section the link is present over there thank you have a nice day